Well, hey there and how are you today? My name is Carla, I am an adult doll collector, you are my hangout, and today we are starting off at Polly's Diner. However, before we get busy with what we're going to be doing here, I just want to address uh, two things. First off, is I had someone ask me where I got the tabletop for the table I built. And I had the white one, but they cut, but you get these at Walmart. They come in white and they also come in this color. And, um, and this, so this is what they look like. And they're usually hanging up on a wall or somewhere. And there you find them in the section with the wood crafting where the wood burning stuff is. And, um, you know, the stuff with the clocks and the wood planks, all that stuff. That's where you'll find these. And it was, I think, two fifty-seven. It was less than three bucks. So I know that, which isn't bad. And the other thing I want to talk about is after I, I made that table, and of course, I then sanded it again and then added another layer of paint. So this is what it looks like after it's been fully sanded. So, and next you just have to make um, chairs and benches to go with that table. But anyway, I just wanted to get those things dressed with you. And now we're going to get on to the other stuff which is I went to Target today and I picked up a few capsules as you can see for series three because now I want to see what's in series three. So yeah, I picked up a few, but yay, series three, all right, all right. So I'm not entirely sure what's in these. I am guessing it obviously one of them is a burger. I can see that. And I'm thinking probably most of what will be in these will be great for this diner. And then I still have to make the bakery. So let's get started, right? because I want to see what we have. Hey, as you can see, they still come in your traditional, you know, clear capsule on top with a little hole. Yep, you still open them up. They still come with a table. That's always good. Um, okay. But they have one set of directions in three languages. Very good, nice, saves on paper. And here is um, the collector's guide. Although I like to call it the catalog for no particularly good reason. And in this one, oh, it's smaller series. Okay, that's all right, that's good. So let's see, oh, there's cupcakes. And then there's, ooh, crepes. What are those? Taiyaki ice cream? Okay. Tell me that isn't actually fish, right? Okay, uh, let's see. We have a Caesar salad. Nice. Veggie skewers. Okay, sushi. All right. Uh, a burger. Tacos. Soup. Jello. Ooh, look at that cake. Ooh, two cakes. Yeah. Okay. I wonder what I'm going to get. Guess we'll find out. Now, I myself, since I have a, um, a handy-dandy oven over here, I don't need to use these capsules. So, I put them aside. Sometimes I use some of the stuff. And so, of course, it still comes with this little thing goes in the top of the capsule that I'm not using. Tongs, which are actually very useful. Let's see if it has any other utensils in here. I'm not seeing any, do you? No, nope, no utensils. All right, so what do we have in the bags? There's like, so this one has one, one, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. Okay, I guess we'll see what's in there. So first off, we have some lettuce. Okay. 
Look at that. That looks cool. I wonder if it's a taco. That would be nice. I love tacos. Now I'm hungry for tacos. Okay, now in here we have, um, what's this? <gasps> okay, it is. It's going to be taco beef. All right. Okay, excellent. And we have in here, we have, ah, okay, <laughs> cheese slices. And by the way, I would, I hope I get more of these because if I can't get a chance to make any of those pizzas, I'm going to tell you, I'm not going to put the cheese sauce on pizza. Just the idea of cheese sauce on pizza is revolting to me. So I was trying to think of how I could make things look like cheese. And so if I get stuff like that, that's perfect. Otherwise, I was just going to cut up some like yellow paper and stuff to make it look like cheese. But I was not going to put cheese sauce on pizza. That just almost sounds like a crime to me. All right, and here we have tacos. Oh, look at those little tacos in there. <laughs> awesome okay let's see now in here this has got to be that what it's a dinosaur right it is it's a dinosaur to hold the taco <laughs> that is gosh my kids would have loved something like that if i'd had been able to make them tacos with and put them in a dinosaur thing they'd have been so happy and the last one is well it's got to be taco sauce right tell me it's yep taco sauce or hot sauce yay all right they're speaking my language. Tacos. It's not even Tuesday, but I'll, I don't care. I'll have tacos anyway. So, um, well, let's make a taco. So, let's see. I'm going to get... Ah. If I can ever get a taco out, here we go. So, here's a taco shell. Looks pretty good, huh? All right. Okay. Save the other taco shell because that won't really fit too. Oh, all right. And then let's see. Okay, now let's see. I would put meat on my taco. Okay, people. Um, for those of you that thought this was obvious to, congratulations. For those of you who are like me, don't feel too bad. You see this line? Yeah, you turn it. Mm-hmm. I'm still trying to lift it up. Yep. I knew that, and I was just testing other people. That's what it was. Okay, so here's what the taco meat looks like. All right. Doesn't look too awful bad. Needs a little more, more meat than that, right? It does. It's missing guacamole. That's what it's missing. All right. There we go. That's a decent amount of taco meat, right? Probably over overfilled. Who knows? All right. I think I'm going to put a little bit of taco sauce on it right now. So let's put a little taco sauce in here. I think. There we go. That isn't too bad. Okay, now let me put in some of the cheese. Gandhi, no, Gandhi, no, Gandhi, no. Sorry. <laughs> I think he's liking being on TV. You know, I keep petting him. And when you put, those of you who tell me, give him, you know, pet him or scratch him or something, I actually do pet him and, or give him a scratch. I say, hey, that's from, the, that's from people on YouTube. They wanted me to give you pets. And maybe he's coming over. He's like, that's how I get extra petting is, you know, I come over and people say, pet me and mama pets me more. I don't, Gandy, you little booger. Go, Gandy. <laughs> <sighs> I'm going to put a little bit more, um, I think that's enough cheese. Okay, put a little more um, taco sauce on. I'm going to put on a little bit of lettuce. 
And I have plenty of this stuff left over. Nice. All right, well, might not be perfect. Okay, I think our taco is ready. Let's get it, whoops, let's get it out. And yes, all right, tacos, yeah. Okay, so we have the little doily, all right. And let's see, what utensils do we have this time? We have... We have a spatula. Okay, that's promising. What's in here? We have... Ooh, chocolate curls. Oh, they're speaking my language now. White chocolate and chocolate. Oh, my goodness. And here we have... This must be the dish or something. I don't know. I do not know. Oh, I love this color. Look at this color. Cake plate. Oh, it's... I love that. Whoops. I like it so much I threw it around. I'm just knocking down everything. Okay. Okay, and here we have... Oh, cool! It's going to be this one. It's going to be a roll cake. All right. Awesome! And what is this? Well, of course, it's the frosting. And it is going to be... Oops. A glaze. All right, well, let me get that sitting upside down. This one is this. Yep, the choco roll cake. That does look delicious. Oh, that's awesome. Oh my goodness. Oh, sorry. I'm even more excited now. So let's see. You can. You can actually have a separate... Oh, that is so fantastic. Look at that. Oh. Oh. Man, I'm even happier now. Let's get the chocolate going here. I think, first of all, I want to make sure that that one piece of cake can sit on the spatula. So I'm going to put that on and then put this on to the cake. Now let's put on some of these chocolate sprinkles, these chocolate things on top. All right. Ah. I'm going to put some of this drizzle on this piece of chocolate roll. And we will bake it. All right, so this one is, what is this? And here we have some, oh, we get to make the crepes this time. All right, yay for crepes. And what do we have in here for a silverware? We get, ah, oh, here we go. The little knife, spatula, whatever, there we go. That's so nicely done, though. Oof. Okay. Okay, we have a platter. 
and we have some strawberry slices. All right. Banana slices. Excellent. And whatever the topping is. Is this supposed to be like chocolate topping? Hazelnut crepes. All right. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. We can do this. I'll try it this way. All right, well, let's bake it and see what happens. And our cake, let's see, our cake is out. And, oh, I love that, that you can just have a, oh. And let's get the next thing. What will we get this time? Okay, so this time we have, for utensils, we have, okay, no other utensils. It ran away from me, and this is some jimmies, some, ooh, look at those pretty colored jimmies. I love when they get those. And then... Ooh, ice cream or vanilla custard? Vanilla custard? What does that look like inside? Oh, okay. Mmm, looks tasty. Is this going to be that fish stack thing? I guess it's going to be that fish thing. Okay. All right. Okay. Well, there. Okay, so here's a little thing that holds them. Okay. Here we have the, uh, <laughs> look at those ice cream cones, oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> wow, do they actually make stuff like this? Oh my god, that's awesome. <laughs> look, I didn't look too closely. See on here, my I guess my eyes aren't very good, but on here I could see it looked vaguely like a fish, but that looks like a lot like a fish. So wow. All right, well let's make some um ice cream cones. Although hold on, we've got the crepes are out. All right. Okay. All right. So let's see. Um. That is really something clever. How clever is that? That is just too much. Oh my gosh. Let's see. All right, so I guess, uh, let's see, I'll put them in the, is there a certain way? Okay, yep, I guess it goes in like that. So I guess they go in like so. All right. OK. 
Okay, I'm going to put a little bit of this stuff in here though, so I can, so it will like, you know, hold the ice cream, the custard stuff. We've got the custard. That is just so awesome. Okay, all right, yep. Yeah. I've got to make a grocery store because I've got to have a place for all the ice cream, containers of ice cream that I have nowadays. All right, and then we put more of this stuff on. Okay, now let's put some sprinkles on. See, I remembered to call them sprinkles this time. Yep, let's put sprinkles on everything while I'm at it. So, um, bake the um, ice cream. Because this is doll world and that's how things work here. Let's check out the next one. So, let's see. Silverware. We have a tong and a thing, and we have a, okay, a spatula again, okay. And here we, ooh, we have some raspberries and some blueberries. Okay, so I haven't seen this one yet then. And we have, let's see, what's this is, uh, Oh, that's kind of interesting. Oh, it's a jello mold. Oh, my goodness. Oh, okay, all right. I was wondering how they were going to do that. Here's the plate for it. And sorry, my nails look so bad. I just, uh, they're just, yeah. And then we have the, yep, the squishy squish. All right. Hey, and what kind of jello is this called? It is called the blue res jelly. Blue res jelly. Okay, all right, yeah. I'm going to put a little bit of stuff in and then some of the berries in. Pop the bubble there. Okay, I've let it cure a bit, so now I'm going to pour some more, um, you know, add some more of this jello stuff. I think I'm just going to keep doing this in layers, maybe. So maybe I can have a goodly supply of, uh, you know, fruit and things through it. Now some of you might be, any of you that are close to my age group, I bet you some of you guys can remember going to relatives houses and seeing all kinds of things combined with jello that defied the laws of nature. And um, there were some scary combinations at one time out there. Kind of enjoying making this one. I do need to pop bubbles. Let's open up the next capsule. All right, so we have a stay fresh. Okay. Uh, okay, 
we have a fork. I love getting silverware. Croutons. Oh, we're getting a salad. Yes. Salad's good. I love salad. And ooh, nice bowl. All right. And oh, lettuce. Oh, that is awesome too. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't know if kids could have more fun with this stuff than I'm having. I don't know. All right, we have some, oh, some grated Parmesan cheese to go on it. Yes. And then, this is going to be salad dressing then, I, or I presume. Oh, here we go. Caesar dressing. How, oh, that's awesome. Okay, well, let's, uh. So, but I, I, I could be wrong. I mean, I could be wrong, but I'm, I'm betting it's a Caesar salad, right? Yeah, yeah, because I'm, I'm clever like that. Yeah, I, cause yeah, I just know stuff. All right, well, let's uh, make ourselves a Caesar salad. That is so. Look at that. Put a little bit of the salad dressing in the bottom of the dish here. The way it'll hold some of the, you know, the other stuff down. in. Well, there you are, little boy. Hi, Gandy. You guys hear that? Gandy has arrived again. Boutons. And let's put some of the grated cheese in there. Now I guess I'll, it's time I can put this in the oven now. Oh, in theory, this should pop out of this mold, right? Okay, all right, all right. Less nervous now, okay. All right. And, oh, all right, it worked. Look at that. All right. Okay, we're on the last ball. Let's see what we have in here. Okay, well, it's something I haven't done on this one yet. So, okay. So, we have this. So, we have oh, cupcakes in the little cupcake tin. Oh, that is so, and oh, and they have the little pink wrappers. <laughs> that is cool. Okay, all right, I guess we'll see what comes in here. And we have, there we go, a little spatula. And that's it. And then here we have some raspberries. Okay. Awesome. And we have some lemon wedges too. Nice. And then we have some berry topping, like berry um, frosting. Right? Yep, all right. They got today. I didn't do too bad. 
I didn't do too bad. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I can do this. I can do this. So first of all, going to All right, and here's the Caesar salad. That looks quite good, actually. I think that came out beautifully. That is wonderful. Then put, let me see, put a little. Get our um, our cupcakes out. Oh, they look pretty, huh? Oh, they look very nice. Well, we have completed this video today. Thank you for joining me while we got to open up and well review the Miniverse Series Three Diner. And I really like them. I like that um, they have some where you can actually have individual um, servings. Because this wasn't the only one that does that. I really like that. I like that the resin came out easier. That was nice. I like the addition of a salad. And the jello. I'm going to tell you, the jello was so much fun to make. It really was. The tacos also. I love the tacos and the, and the little dinosaur on there. I mean, come on, you know, how cute is that? I, and this just, yes, it's a, it, it does not have a whole lot of things in the series, but they're pretty wonderful what they, what we have though. And I believe I can reuse this mold so I can make another kind of a jello mold I guess so yeah so that, I think it was great I like I like this series so far I'm pretty impressed with it so if you like this video please hit like please hit subscribe if you're not a subscriber if you are a subscriber obviously I appreciate that you're a subscriber you know I love you guys for that um, comment down below let me know what you think of, of this um, did you have a favorite one um, do they actually serve these fish um, ice creams anywhere I'm gonna admit when I first heard about fish ice cream I was like ice fish flavored ice cream I don't know how I feel about that but if it's in something like this I can see that and that's actually just kind of really cool actually <laughs> That that's just that was just such a give me such a chuckle. So if you know about those, please definitely uh, yeah let me know about that. Um, the crepes, yeah the crepe I like the crepes. The crepes are okay. I neither liked them or disliked them, but I enjoyed the salad and I love the idea of the taco too. And yeah, this is this is nice. So like I said, definitely comment down below. Sharing is caring, and so go ahead and share this video with other people, especially because the Series 3 is still fairly new, and so if you know someone who's also curious about Series 3, go ahead and share this with them so they can see what is in it and how cool some of these things are. I mean, come on. This itself, so cool. I'm just like thoroughly impressed with that. It's just, just awesome, awesome sauce right there. So, um, thank you for giving me some of your time. I hope all of you have a fantastic day. So again, I'm out of here. You guys take care and goodbye.